You know, I recognize this house. I think that there's an underground bunker area. I can sell that. You guys gonna... Ah, synchronize. Neat. Sorry that I couldn't give you guys synchronized beatings. Alright, kitchen, kitchen, kitchen. Please have stuff for me. Oh, you got my cooking pot. Oh, that's a mine. You're friggity frack, man. Hey there, stud. Ah, yes. Empty jars is exactly what I wanted. This game knows, just knows me. But hops? Well, at least I can start growing my own hops and then make beer. Eh. Let's... There we go. I think that's trash. No, it's a purse. That sucks. Got it. Potato seeds? Well, the good news is I am acquiring lots of good <laughs> Oh man, I have people sleeping where I live. I can't be screaming like that. <laughs> Oh man, these scrap boots don't really go with my outfit, but they're better than the cowboy boots, armor-wise. Headshots at your friend. Some, some more die. That's nice. Not even remotely what I wanted, but you know, it's. I'm not gonna complain. So I will eat you. All right, well, that clears up this house. Or 
for as much as I'm going to loot it right now. Hello there, friend. Care to join me on my walk back to my house? Nope, you just carry on throwing hands. Alright, so we've just dumped all of our inventory off. What is our food situation looking like? Our food situation is looking bad. Wow, alright. So I am not really gaining any ground with this whole food thing. We do have some corn over here. Which means... Not that I can actually... I, mean, I can plant stuff in a farm. I mean, I can get that going, but I'm not going to be getting any, like, profitable yield until I can invest in living off the land. Oh, but look at all these potats, though. Oh, that makes me happy. Does that mean you have more food inside? Ooh, you have something underneath the... That is dirt. I got excited about the dirt. Oh, I see a workbench. Could you be the one? Don't mind me, I'm just recovering my stamina, dude. Uh, you chill there so I can beat you with more vigor. Did she just do a superhero landing? That was actually pretty cool. Wish all my fangirls did that. All two of them. A secret. Okay, all one of them, and then me wearing a dress. Schematic. More, wow, this game wants me to drink. That is the message I am picking up. Let's see here. Nothing up here. Were those high-performance sneakers? They are. I might switch to those when I'm encumbered. But not right now. Right now, we're just going to be getting all of this not food. You know what? I need looter goggles. I need the lucky looter goggles. In my life. Oh, what's up there, buddy? At night, when the adrenaline is rushing, you will never- Oh, sweet. Not that I'm doing a lot at night, but at least I won't be encumbered. Alright, alright. Not too shabby. 
I mean, I'm still not super excited with the amount of action that's happening. I mean, even playing this, not the most exciting. I'll admit it. This is why most Let's Players, I think, do uh, over-the-top stuff or play with multiple people. Okay, that was pretty funny. But I'm surviving. You. I think part of it is also because I'm on edge right now. Because <laughs> I really don't want to get my butt kicked. Alright, I'm going to hold off on eating that for the moment. How are we looking? I guess I probably should eat that. And we'll drink all of these. Not only to give us some more room. But mostly just to give us more room. Hello, hello. Well, neat. I feel like... I feel like I missed the good stash. Probably because I didn't go up here. Making a bet right now that there's a dog up here. Wait. I thought her eyes were glowing for a second. I thought, don't give me ferals already, game. All right, 1900. Loot what we can. Wake up Arlene. What do we got up in here? You know, I mean, they're all good schematics. They're just not the good schematics that I currently want right now. Come on. All this episode. Spending 20 minutes trying to get into a purse. Oh, well, you know, I had bullets, so I guess it wasn't completely worthless. What do we got here? Not the one I wanted. Well, that's the one I want, the food one, so I'll be able to find food a little bit easier now. Oh, there's all my red dye. So, I have six more spots left. Free up a or an inventory spot. Let's make you look like a skull cap. Ah, 
And I want to go up there, but I'm running out of daytime and space. So we'll mark this on the map. So that I'll remember to come back. But first, I'm going to take out this Zombu, and then I'm going <laughs> That Zombu is like, I'm going to pretend I'm hurt, then they'll take pity on me. No. No, I'm just an asshole. I'm just going to beat you with my club. Oh, great. That was useless. Let me run back to base here. Drop all this stuff off. We got a little bit of time, but not enough time to really make a difference as far as going back to that house and grabbing the rest of the loot. So I'll finish kind of cleaning up the house a little bit. And once I get a wrench, I will be able to start really taking apart some of these appliances. So I'm just going to stay in this house for ever. This is my life. This is my house now. All right, back to the nighttime. Let's take another look around. No, I've actually done a pretty good job at cleaning this place up. Other than the giant gaping holes in the ceiling, but we can ignore that for right now. Yeah, I definitely want to open this place up more, but I need better. So let's do this one, two. Start evening out this place, and I'm going to end up leveling off this top area. And you know, make it so that I can see the zombies, put some bars up, shoot them before they can get too close to me. Like I, I mentioned in the previous episode, I have done the challenge on my own, so I do know it's possible. Um, though I didn't do it the same way. Uh, one version of the max attribute challenge that I did was uh, I couldn't spend any points into the tree until that attribute was maxed out. Uh, but that didn't stop me from... So I would max out perception, and then I would start buying points of perception without maxing everything out. Uh, this playthrough... I'm doing a more intense challenge where I'm maxing all of these out before I can start spending anything down here, which is why I'm just letting my points pool up. I'm going to spend them all at one time and get them all and go from one to ten all at once. So yeah, well, thank you guys all for tuning in. Again, let me know what you think in the comments below. Uh, like if you are enjoying this, subscribe so you don't miss out on more, and share it with your friends. But until next time, everybody, I am Axel for Burning and Yang, and as always, you stay fired up.